at the end of 1999, uh, uh, Ralph Klein felt the heat. Uh, yeah. and, uh, and especially after, in 2000, he, he brought in what was called the Health Care Protection Act, Bill 11, which was an, uh, uh, an act to allow more, to allow non-hospital surgical facilities. Now, which is an oxymoron. If you've got a surgical facility where they do operations and they keep people overnight, but it's not a hospital. Okay. Well, it's a hospital. It, there's, that, that's how you define a hospital is with overnight stays for acute care. Yeah. But they were called non-hospital surgical facilities because all hospital care under the Canada Health Act has to be public, you know, has yeah. to be publicly funded. So these are non-hospital surgical facilities. And he brought in Bill 11, the Health Care Protection Act, to allow for the expansion of private hospitals and for the HRC at the, at the Grace Hospital in Calgary to become uh, a private hospital. Yep. Now, the Friends of Medicare uh, at that time mounted a very big campaign against this uh, and uh, in my time it was the most successful campaign and it was protracted and long and built up over time. Strongly supported by UNA and other unions, uh, there was a, a good financing for it, um, leafleted door to door across the province, Albertans did not want and do not want private hospitals and private health care and they said so. Um, perhaps the, the, the most brilliant tactical thing we did at that time was to hold very large public meetings in Calgary and in Edmonton. Just, just as Bill 11 was on the floor of the legislature. Mm -hmm. uh, so there were, we brought 10,000 people uh, with, there was a, a lot of campaigning and gone on for a long time and we leafleted door to door across the mm -hmm. province um, and uh, got 10,000 people to a big event in Calgary at the Saddle Dome. And part of the way we did that is uh, we got uh, Kiefer Sutherland to come, uh, Tommy Douglas's grandson and the famous actor and he came and uh, his, his mother Shirley Douglas uh, came to speak. Uh, so it became a major cause, and it was seen nationally as being the, the, uh, the front line of the attack on our public health care system and the front line of the defense of our public health care system. So we had, and Mary Walsh came. And so we had huge crowds in, in, in Calgary and, and Edmonton. And we got other speakers, Wally Temple, uh, a, a, a prominent uh, um, cancer surgeon from Calgary came and said, uh, some things are not for commerce not children uh, and not, not health care. It's just not Who's for that again? That His name's Dr. Wally Temple okay. and he spoke. So have you, uh, we put online a little while ago uh, the movie we made with Don Bozak right after Bill 11 called This Is What Democracy Looks Like and it's online and you can get it, you can see it from our website and it, it documents the Bill 11 campaign and those big, big, big meetings. So after those big meetings we called a rally at the legislature the next day. And a lot of, more people than we expected came uh, and they were very mad about Bill 11 and um, they were on the steps of the legislature and I got a call at home and I said, you got to get down here. Uh, things are really hot. And I got down there and they'd stormed into the legislature building, into the rotunda and up the stairs towards the assembly. And there was a crowd of 300 people um, mad as heck about this who are ready to storm the legislature and they, they, they stopped there on the steps but they were chanting on the steps and the people in the, the MLAs were meeting inside in the, in the assembly and they could hear the people chanting on the steps going up into the assembly and they were scared. So, um, and, and then that was the beginning of night after night. Every night oh, yeah. that, that week we had uh, people grew and uh, it's, it was a great thing and there was lots of activity and great chance. Well, this, this, this had a huge impact. It scared the heck out of the government. So they modified uh, Bill 11 dramatically. They mailed everybody in the province with a glowing leaflet about how uh, Bill 11 was there to be the Health Care Protection Act, which was, you know, it was there to, you know, make private hospitals possible, and they call it the Health Care Protection Act. So, 
Uh, and uh, there's a great clip of Ralph, in our movie, there's a great clip of Ralph Klein saying, we would never do anything to erode Medicare, you know? And, and they keep saying this, we would never do anything to uh, hurt your public health care folks. Uh, but w they modified it, and they modified the, the Bill 11 to where they actually ended up quite tightly restricting what what could be a private hospital and a private surgical facility. And we still have that in place today. So they did not do what they wanted to do, was uh, open it wide open for private health care. In the end, uh, the Health Care Protection Act uh, set some really strong parameters about, around uh, what could be allowed in, in uh, in, in private hospitals. So uh, the, the, the huge rallies were a success in, in one sense. Uh, uh, they did pass the bill and they weren't, they weren't going to allow themselves to be talked out of passing the bill, but they passed a much amended act that actually did in some ways uh, prevent a huge expansion of private hospitals. And that, happen, and that happened in, in, uh, in 2000, in the spring of 2000.